Hey guys, Tawaz Man here. Um, sorry for the huge delay on episode 5. Again, my laptop LCD was cracked. I hooked it up to my TV, which displays my screen in a lower resolution in this video. So, like, instead of my um, episodes being in 14, 1440p, this is probably going to be, in, like, in 720 or 480 at max. So anyway, I'm, uh, let's get right into the news. I think we left off at Mount Moon. Um, let's do this shit. Alright, so just a quick refresher, these are my two Pokemon, they're gonna be my two Pokemon for a while, cause I already have my team planned out. Um, good shit. Let's go. First fucking encounter, wonderful. Um, I might as well start, uh, describing the new encounters here. Paris is a trash Pokemon, has trash typing, trash stats, it does get an exclusive move, and it, 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 does and it does learn cut, which you'll need to escape the next city, which isn't the worst idea in the world. So if you want to catch it, catch it. Like I'll do right here, cause I f I feel like it. And then I realize I don't have any f potions. Fuck me. Um, not potions, pokeballs. I guess we're gonna run back to Pokemans. Yay. Fuck. Alright. And fuck. Give me all of your Pokeballs. Um. Three are good. Um. I might as well also get an escape rope while I'm at it. Because it'll help you escape the dungeon, Mount Moon. Ah, shit. Run the- run the- went the- bleh, Went the wrong way. And... boop. Shit. God damn it. Yeah, using fast forward is not the optimal tactic. Anyway, we're back in Mount Moon. Perfect! Um... This is not what I want, but, like, I'll go for it anyway. So the Pokemon here are gonna be... I might as well also explain Zubat. Zubat is a poison flying type. A unique type, actually. Only it and its other evolution share it. Yeah. Um, it's not the best Pokemon because it doesn't have... It doesn't get Crobat in Generation 1, and all of it... And most of its stats are just... Bleh. And especially with psychic types being so rampant everywhere, you're gonna have a hard time using it. It is still a decent Pokemon, it just doesn't get the best moves in the world. Down here, we have a thing. TM12. I believe this is Water Gun, which is kind of stupid that it's in the TM thing, but TMs in Generation 1 are a lot different than in, like, Later generations, like, heck, even two, which had some weird shit, like, Nightmare, Rollout, um, Dynamic Punch, Iron Tail, yeah. Holy shit, level 16, let's go. What?! Oh, shit. When Pokemon get to a certain level, they evolve. You could press B to cancel, but I don't feel like it. Bulbapedia is now Ivypedia. I should fucking go to hell for that joke. Holy shit, another Pokeball! I want it! God damn it. Alright. Might as well switch Unicorn to the front. Suspicious men are in the cave. What about you? I have two Pokemon. Fuck you. Um, I also think the bottom of, like, my task bar is also showing a little, so... Sorry about that again. Um, but whatever. Uh, okay, apparently that's super effective. Cool. Uh, fuck it. I don't think we're gonna get through this whole dungeon in one episode. Um, this might take two or three. At least two. 
because Mount Moon is a bit of a long one. Is about to use Kakuna. Um, no, I don't want to change. Well, Catcher sent out Kakuna. Oh boy. And some people are pulling out from a driveway nearby. That's wonderful. So, Hurricane Irma exists. And it's fucking over Florida right now. Holy shit, level 16 again. Holy fuck. Hell yeah, baby. You got me? Wait. Oh. Two evolutions in one video, baby! <laughs> Need a Reno! Alright. Oh, how much XP? 486. 565. And someone just rang my phone. Okay, it's my little brother. I don't know what the fuck he just did, but like, I don't give a shit. Because I'm filming. Um, it says pissing in a frog asserts your manliness now. How about now? Um, let's keep going. What? I'm waiting for my friends to find me here! You're at the entrance, you dumb bitch. Jesus fucking Christ. Alright, Clefairy. This is a, actually a thing you can encounter here, although it is very rare. Clefairy is actually a decent normal type. Um, you can evolve it right now because it evolves with a Moonstone. Like my precious Nidorino. It does learn a wide variety of moves, but its stats are kind of eh. It is a good Pokemon. If you're looking for a normal type, I would definitely get it. Because you don't get... Because, like, this is the best normal type you're gonna get for a while. And why is it pounding me? I'm not... Oh, fucking critical. I also explained in last episode how criticals work differently in, like, the rate it is. But it, I, it also works differently in, like... The damage it does. It actually depends on your level. Like, critical hits won't do two times unless you're at 100 health. Unless you're at level 100, which isn't really possible in the main story. Um, yeah. Instead, it, I think it does something like it's an exponential function. Alright. Paris right here. That's a thing. Let's do this, son of a bitch. That's about half. A bit less. I will seed it. What? The one in two five. Uh, no, it's actually. What? Stop. Stop! Oh, it's. It's part grass type. Might as well chuck balls at it. Un, do, no. Fuck. Maybe I can weaken it with Vine Whip. And yes, Vine Whip only has 10 PP, which pisses me off. To no end. Alright, that's good. Alright, chuck another ball at it. Alright, Paris was caught. I'm gonna call you slave. A cut slave. I might get a flash slave. Well, then again, Pikachu was a flash slave, but I didn't feel like catching it. Or did I? I'm going to call you... Fuck. I'm gonna call you fuck. So fuck you. Alright, I'm up. Well, let's go downstairs. I should also heal. Um, fuck doesn't get anything. Just fuck this fuck. Yeah. So, Ivysaur is gonna be- Uh, Bulbapedia is gonna be a bit better than Unicorn, but that's just for now. Oh, there's a Clefairy. 
Yeah, it's more common on the lower floors than in the upper. There's also one more Pokemon that we haven't encountered yet. I think at least. I think you can catch, like, something in yellow here, but I don't think. Um, yeah. Just a bunch of bullshit and your way. Dead end. You will find those a lot. Bing, 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 bing. Um, I'm just gonna run. Cause there are plenty of, sh there's plenty of shit to grind on later. Well, actually, really, there isn't. Well, I don't know. Holy shit. Okay, be buying fucking escape rope was pointless. Let's head down here. Go through this cave to go to Cerulean City. Thanks for the tip. Bug catcher. Caterpies. Level 10. Why? Um, anyway. I'm just gonna fast forward through this. This is gonna be really boring without it. Oh, fuck. Yay, level 17. Bug catcher. I lost. Most accurate fucking reaction you could have right there. <laughs> uh. Hold the fuck up. You know what? Have your fucking rare candy. And we're right here. This is where we need to go. And this is where we are. I could've just pressed down, I could have just pressed up twice, but no, I went through the painstaking trouble to press down like a fucking million times. Good stuff. And we're going through the fucking endless shit. What? Don't sneak up on me. Really? Magnemite. You can't catch this a lot later, so I'm not going to explain it. I'm pretty sure that you're... When can you catch a Magnemite? I'm fucking forgetting, because my knowledge on red and blue is not the best, but... It's better than, like, fucking Gen 1ers. Voltorb, you also can't catch this for a while, so I'm not going to explain it. Again, I'm also going to address one more thing with critical hits. It it ignores all of your stat ups and downs. So, like, if you use the stat boosting move, um, say, Swords Dance four times, no, Swords Dance twice, and then you got a critical, the critical would actually do less than the fucking whatever normal hit. But it, it also ignores your opponent's stat ups and stat downs. So, like, say something used... Acid Armor, which is basically the defense equivalent of Swords Dance, two times, your critical hits would deal six times damage than they normally would, and if you're using on a quad weak Pokemon, say, Paris, and you use like a fire move, it will do 18 times damage, 24 if you encounter for whatever. No, um, but through the dungeon that I can't fucking remember. Maybe I go up here? I think I go up here. <sighs> Fuck off! Wow, it's way bigger in here than I thought. 
Insert offensive. Oh, fuck off. Oddish, you can't catch this until after Cerulean. So I'm not going to explain it now, but basically the gist of it, it's a grass poison type of decent special. And not much else to say. It, it, um, one more thing. It's family is the only... Um, yay, level 17. It's family is the only Pokemon able to learn Petal Dance, which is, I think, a 90 power move that is basically the grass equivalent of Thrash. Thrash is essentially a 90 power move that, like, continues for two, to th two or three turns, and then it confuses you. Critical hit. Yay. Oh, I lost it. What did you lose? Your virginity? Aha! I think it's this one. Yeah. Alright. Nope. Uh, whatever. Um, let's go grab this item. TMO one. I think that's Mega Punch. Right there. I'll go check. Yep, Mega Punch. Hold on, um, I want to do like something special for like the Team Rocket fuckers. We're pulling a big job here. Get lost, kid. Oh God, that's gonna be so fucking annoying. Yeah, this is the first place you can counter Team Rocket, which is basically the boogeyman of this game. They aren't really that hard, to be honest. I mean, like, you just kill them. One more thing I want to explain is that Bug is super effective against Poison, and Poison is super effective against Bug. Go figure. Uh, the, oh boy. Fuck off. Um, I'm gonna use Poison Sting. Fuck. Wait, why is it doing Poison? Why? 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 Are you fuck? Ah! Stop! 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 Thank you. Rocket yays. So you are good. Oh God. Oh what? Super. Ah, whatever. Ah, fuck. <laughs> oh, boy. This is gonna be fucking amazing. Great A shit. I love it. I'm gonna fucking kill myself. No, I'm not. No, I'm kidding. Kidding about not kidding. I don't know. Oh boy. This is gonna be good stuff here, boys. Um. I think I'm just gonna stop here. Sorry if this is a bit of a shorter episode than usual, but I just kinda got shit to do. Uh, anyway. Uh, bye, guys. E yay.